we're going to take this hyperbola that has been converted into standard form and find all of the information required for graphing. We have x minus 5 squared over 4 minus y plus 2 squared over 9 equals 1. The center can be found at 5 comma negative 2. For a hyperbola, we add a squared and b squared. a squared is 4, b squared is 9, a squared plus b squared, 13. So c is the square root of 13. To find the foci, we need to change one of the variables from the center. x is the first variable that you see in the equation. That's what we'll be changing. We'll have 5 plus and minus the square root of 13 for our new x, comma, negative 2. The transverse axis is simply a fancy way of saying a. 4 is a squared. a is 2. We'll use the transverse axis, 2, that we just found, along with the center, to find the vertices. Again, we change the x. 5 minus 2 is 3, comma negative 2. And we do 5 plus 2, which is 7, comma negative 2. The only part remaining is to find the slopes of the asymptotes. Remember, there is a positively sloped asymptote and a negatively sloped asymptote. This is a horizontal hyperbola. So it's found by doing b over a. Remember, whatever is underneath the y always goes on top. We'll have the square root of 9 over the square root of 4, which is 3 over 2, plus minus 3 halves is the slope for the asymptotes. Now it's ready to be graphed.